y'all what's up welcome back to another video i know it's been so long so so long and i know i look like crap right now but guys we just got back from our trip from julia prison in illinois and that was so much fun like i'm gonna post it on tiktok because i didn't get a lot of footage but i got a gopro now so hopefully i can start taking better quality quality videos um and see where we go from here i'm super excited to do this you guys um but yeah, we got more trips coming up, so stay along. Good morning, y'all. Good morning, good morning, good morning. It is Monday, June 12th, and I'm currently at work. Right now, I am waiting for a TikTok to upload, and then, let's sit y'all back down, and then I am going to go straighten up the house. So right now I'm waiting for that to upload. I'm waiting also for my email from my boss and then I'm gonna go straighten up and I'll check back in with you guys then. Y'all, it's cold as hell in this house. It's all nasty and rainy and everything outside. And it's making it super cold in this house. Let me just turn this way because apparently I have no light in my house. I'm trying to get used to this GoPro but I'm just getting the house cleaned up. Just got done eating a little bit. I'm about to start cooking um, some chicken dip and then probably gonna get back to work. There's not really gonna be a lot that goes on. I just got back from Illinois yesterday, so I'm trying to chill. There's not gonna really be a lot to happen, so. If you want to see what I did in Illinois, go check me out on TikTok. My TikTok will be linked. It will not be linked. My TikTok information will be right here at the bottom of the screen. Go look me up. Go follow me. We do weekend vlogs over there. Um, but go check me out. I'll talk to you all in a little bit. Bye. All right, y'all. So now I'm going to make my dinner. Making chicken dip. So I'm going to go ahead and put some chicken in here. Apparently it's still a little frozen, so I'm just gonna slap it in there. We're gonna put some Rotel dip in there. I had to literally go get my mirror with a light on it because I have no clue where my ring light is. I haven't <laughs> posted a video in so long, so yeah, there's a lot of stuff everywhere. I used to use my phone. Now I'm on a GoPro. Is the quality better? I wouldn't know, honestly. I haven't posted one from this GoPro yet. So we're going to see. I'm going to drain some of this juice out. And it's just some whole kernel corn. I put two cans. I like a lot of corn. And I didn't get my I didn't get any black beans we don't really eat beans I know tragedy but I do eat them every now and then but not a lot and then we're gonna put some green chilies in here too Okay, I don't know what happened there, but now we're gonna take this Fiesta Ranch Mix and we're gonna put it in here too. Then we're just gonna take some Philadelphia cream cheese and plop it in there too. Now I'm going to mix it up because I used the large crock pot this time and didn't use the small one. So I gotta fill this up. There we go. And this is what it looks like. And 
and I will be back with you guys when it is done. I'm just going to cook it for four hours, three hours, and then after three hours, shred the chicken, leave it cooking for another hour. So, hey guys, <clears throat> just got out of the shower. Um, hold on, because it's about to be really dark in my room. Okay, just got out of the shower, and I'm just getting to moisturize in my face and stuff. Let me get y'all set up here. Don't mind all my junk everywhere. Oh, today has been a day. I have not been feeling like being on this camera, even though I did just get it. I want to use it, but I want to plan a trip and use it there more because there's not a lot for me to do around this house but clean and cook and work that's it i ain't been going nowhere actually i just got back so i won't be going nowhere for a little while <sighs> does everybody have plans for their fathers for father's day anybody taking them anywhere out to eat what y'all get your fathers for father's day I'm struggling because mine has everything, literally everything, and I don't want to get him the cheesy mug that says you're the best dad ever or a blanket with all our pictures on it, like, that shit's cute and stuff, but what if you've already done that? What if you've already hit that stage? I don't know. It might just be me, but I'm trying to take my dad to do something. I think uh, I'm going to take him to a Louisville Bats game. He's been saying, and apparently he's been wanting to do that, so mom helped me out with that one. Told me that's what he was talking about he wanted to do. So that's probably what I'm gonna do is take all of us to go see that the game which are actually pretty cheap to do so if you're in the Louisville area and want to do something kind of cheap for your father's day I think I only paid like 20 bucks I don't know why it turns off after so long I'm kind of struggling with that but I think it's only like 20 bucks and you can take them to see a game these are the people before they hit pros, the, what you call them. Before they hit pro, they go here. Oh my God. But yeah, that's what I think I'm going to be doing. And then, I don't know, we have a few concerts coming up, so we may, I may not do a lot until then. Ouch. And then I will probably, actually I will bring you all along, but I don't know if I can take the camera in there. I'm not used to vlogging on anything but my phone so we'll see about that but yeah I'm gonna go ahead and wash my face and stuff and finish cooking this dinner I actually think I need to be in there shredding the chicken y'all got a filling uh Wednesday of last week and my jaw is still sore right here and if I think about it that's actually where the numbing wore off less like the numbing wore off um, last right here and it took the longest to come back but yeah I'm gonna go in here and 
finish up and then I will be back in a little while. Hello again. I am just filling up this bowl with water so that I can water some of my plants. Cause they need some love, girl. They need some love. All right. The nice little spider over there. So, let's scooch all up. Y'all just need not to judge my everything, everything at all. There's my spider plant. She's ginormous. Had her forever. And she needs a little bit of love. So we're gonna give her some water. We're just gonna bottom water. Stick her right in there. Hopefully she don't overflow. Nah. There we go. And she's got a little mouth open here. So I'm just gonna tilt her. So she can get her some water in there and we're gonna let her drink <sighs> let me show you her babies so I gave my mom one of her babies and then this is her baby too this I grew off of her I got one of her babies off a couple of her babies off and just put her in there and she's been growing really well now i also have this one which is also her babies and then my mom also has some at her house and we just have a lot of spider plants i also have another one over there that i'm going to get down here in just a minute and then i gave some of her babies also to my mother. I think I'm actually going to cut off some of these big ones that's on here and try to get some roots on some of these. She don't have a whole lot. But let's get some. not that big this one's pretty big let's get one two well shoot three take these let's see maybe this one too she's kind of big now what we'll do is actually I'm gonna just leave y'all there and I'll fill up the jar Uh, it's a jar of water and we're just gonna plop them right down in there this jar is a little big but this jar was given to me by my mom that had a vine plant in it so had a bunch of them but yeah we're just gonna put it in there like that and then I'm gonna stick her up in the window until she roots and then when she roots, I'll put her either in that big one over there that I just showed you or the one hanging up in the window over here. All right, now we'll just stick her in the window like that. And she'll grow with some babies. And then we can plant them. This is also a plant I have. I've had this for like two years now. It's a succulent. And then this one is too. 
I've had this for like two years now also, and it's a succulent. But yeah. So, oh. And then my love got me this one, which is kind of like a little cactus thing. Let me get it in the sun so you can see it. It's so cute. I loved it so much. I just set it right there. But yeah, so I'm going to continue watering these plants and then we'll be back. Now we have this spider plant that's got quite a few little babies on it too. So we're going to stick her in here and get her some water because she needs some too. Actually, we're going to get her some more water because that first one took it all. drink some water. I don't know if you all can see. It's not really moving that much like it usually does. They really already had water but they were looking kind of, they weren't looking as green as I wanted them to. So we um, are going to give her some water. I hope for the best. She got some yellowing. All right, so we're gonna take these big babies off. And just a couple, cause I like the look of the babies on there. Fill up another cup. Of water. You guys can't even see. We'll get us a couple of these big ones. Like this one right here. She's huge. We're gonna stick her in there. Let her root. We will leave those two there. And let's see. Yeah, she got a big one over here. So we will get this one. We'll see if those two will root. I'm sure they will because they did before. We'll stick those there. God, they look so much alike. But they are two different plants. So, yeah. I'm going to tilt it a little bit. Get any air bubbles out that's under there. But yeah, so those are my plants. Did you all see my aloe plant? I don't even know if I showed you. This is my aloe plant I've also had for many, many years. She's a big one. I love, love, love her. She was not doing very well there for a little while because I think I overwatered her. So like all her little limbs were like way down here, like all hung over like this one. It was all like laying flat and now she's starting to stand back up. So she's doing really good. I'm really excited for her. And then my nice little pot my mom got me. So cute. And then this is the vine plant that she got me. Which was also really cute. I love, love, loved it. And it wasn't doing very well, but I kind of just, for being honest, I kind of just drowned it with water because it was drying up a little bit. And she came back and we have a little bit of new growth right there got us a new leaf there yeah so we will let her sit there of course my precious pothos they're coming back and i'm so excited lenny lenny has is now out well gosh dang let me just make the loudest amount of noise so let's see if we can see her if she'll let us see her Probably not, but this is Lenny. She's a little nervous. She's gotten so big though. I wish she'd show her face. But yeah. That's Lenny. 
She's doing really good. She's 10 times bigger than she was probably the first time you guys seen her. She's super heavy too, like, I don't know. It's just crazy to me how fast that they grow. But yeah, so I'm gonna go ahead and finish watering my plants and I'll check back in with you guys here in a second when I start doing this um, food. All right, so we're gonna make this dinner now. I'm gonna chop up some veggies. Get everything ready. We're gonna have some chicken salad for dinner. See how that goes. I bought this new dressing. It's not new, it's new to me. Chipotle Ranch dressing, zero net carbs, zero calories, and fat free. And on the little plastic, it says it's keto friendly. But it looks like this. We're gonna try it. So. Let's see. First, we'll cut up some lettuce. This is a mess. these yellow parts I think they taste awful so that's what I'm trying to get out now salad today. I have literally made a mess. A mess, a mess, a mess. So, but yeah, that's what we're doing now. So I'm going to do that and I'll be back with you guys when it's done. Beach or possibly to Tennessee. Y'all know I love Tennessee. I just love being in that atmosphere and see going through all the mountains, staying in the cabin, like it's love. I love it. But I've never been to Myrtle Beach, so, and I know my girlfriend's never been either. So maybe we'll take a trip there. See what I can do. Oh, yeah. I'm gonna go ahead and get these done, and then I'll check back in with you all a little later. 
Hey y'all. We getting ready to do this laundry. Look at this. Ridiculous. When you literally load your bed up with laundry and ignore it until it's time for you to lay down. Usually you just push it to the side. Yeah. I'm actually going to put it away though. But yeah. I'm going to get to doing that and I'll talk to you tomorrow. Well, good morning, everyone. Good morning, Lenny. Good morning, dogs. Good morning, you guys. It is a great morning. It is now Thursday. And again, we're just going to work from home and do nothing. Because that's what we do. What? <sighs> what? What is it? What is it? He's a good boy. He's a good boy. Yeah, him he is. He made sure to get up this morning and come and tell me good morning. All right, so I'm gonna go feed the cats and Lenny and the dogs. Like I do every morning. And then I'll check back in with you guys a little bit later. Hey, y'all. So, it is now Monday the 19th. And I didn't finish an outro. So, this is me starting a new vlog. So, I'm going to go ahead and end out this next one. I want to thank you guys so much for watching. Um, I'm sorry this vlog was kind of all over the place. I'm kind of getting in the groove of vlogging again. I'm not really used to it anymore. And I don't really do a lot. So... But I want to thank you guys so much for getting us over 200 subscribers and we're still going and I'm so happy about it. I'm so excited about it. I'm so excited to continue this journey with you guys. So I just want to thank you guys so much and continue to share and get all these likes and everything. Thank you all so much. But yeah, I'm going to end this here and I'll talk to you all into the next one. Bye.